Good, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Good evening, my dear students. We all understand how we are in the 2023 session of the Cameroon GC exams organized by the Cameroon GC board. And we are already in the month of May, which means that very soon, in a few or couple of days, we shall be entering into the GC examination. Now we should understand that our subject is structured in two sessions. We have paper one, which carries 50 multiple choice questions. We have paper two, which has about six questions for students to answer any four possible questions of their choice. Now, as I'm going to be giving you possible questions, we will begin right off with the importance of commerce because you cannot do a subject without looking at its importance. We have to know that commerce is important to our society. And if students, for instance, are asked in an exam, still and explain the importance of commerce. Let's say, for instance, 10 marks. As a candidate, you should be able to understand that you need to come up with at least four points and explain them briefly. We have one. We say commerce creates a job opportunity. For instance, there are businesses that have been created today, and these businesses are there to employ some persons who do not have jobs. So that is the meaning of commerce creating employment opportunity. We also say commerce improves the living standard of the people in the society by providing them variety of goods. What I mean here, my dear students, is that different firms producing different types of goods enable customers to benefit from variety and as well as benefiting from high quality. Commerce, again, as point three, encourages what? Specialization. Different companies are going to specialize in the production of different aspects, which equally benefit the consumers. We also say point four, commerce generates government revenue. Commerce generates government revenue in the sense that we have businessmen, we have companies that have been created, we have business activities that are being run in the country. All these, whether it is businessmen, activities, or companies, they are paying taxes to the government. And once the government receives taxes, that is a way in which we see it increases what government revenue. Commerce leads to what is is a source of what information. Buyers and sellers link up themselves as a result of commerce, and they can know they can get information about the possible existence of certain goods in certain areas as well as their prices. Commerce again facilitates mass production. Commerce facilitates mass production in the sense that companies are going to produce in large quantity and they will produce in large quantity because they benefit from what? The high market opportunity. And once they are producing in this large quantity, they are benefiting from economies of large scale production. So those are few importance of commerce. We have said commerce helps to link what? It has to link the gap between the producers and the consumer. How does it link the gap between the producers and the consumers? We have to 